Holy smell, not a poo grass. Hey! Hi, everybody! Welcome to the Whiskey Heat. This world headquarters right here in Fort McMurray, Alberta, where it's always 5 o'clock. Yep, and you can tell by the clock that says 5 o'clock. Today, Moon Distillery. I only have a sheet because I just wanted to let you know. I paid for this stuff, but they sent me a lovely letter. Yeah. They said, Hi, Ty. Thank you for your support of the Moon Distillery in Victoria, BC. As a small family business, we truly appreciate your order. We hope you thoroughly enjoy the Antifogmatic Bliss Single Malt Whiskey mm -hmm. and the Three Sheets to the Moon Cask Strength Whiskey. Yep. We love your YouTube channel and can't wait to hear your thoughts on the Moon Distillery's whiskey. Thank you again for your support of our distillery. We hope you enjoy. Cheers. The Moon Distillery team. Wow. Very cool. Thank you so much for the letter. Thank you so much for the letter. <laughs> My pleasure, really. <laughs> Today, we'll open that shit. This. Yes. Yeah. Josh, this is the anti-fogmatic bliss. Anti-fogmatic is an old term for a bracing beverage. Anti-fogmatic is a drink that sailors would have before going out in the morning into bad oh. weather. A bracing beverage. Oh, okay, okay. Ooh. Sounds weird. I'm pouring for myself first because I'm jealous. This color is absolutely beautiful. Yeah, it so, is. I'm excited, like beyond belief for this. This is uh, made first, spends three years in an American Russian Imperial aged stout barrel for three years. Then it gets transferred for two years into a Caribbean rum barrel with Lees. Josh, what's Lees? So like um, you distill <laughs> a product and you're left with like this cloudy kind of oily thing that's left. And they basically scoop it out and re-add that shit. It gives like a, a certain texture and certain vibes that you're going to get from it. So, yeah. I don't know. What do you sound? Not a poo glass. No, man. I don't know what's happening. You take that one. It sounds fucking awesome. <laughs> the whiskey does smell good. Something about that's reminding me a little bit of Oloroso, but whatever. <laughs> The color on this is phenomenal. So this is uh, coming in at 42% alcohol. I yeah, don't know if yeah. you mentioned that. And it's 100% Vancouver grown, Vancouver Island grown barley. That's correct. Yeah, so 20 cool. minutes, so sorry, cool. 20 kilometers from the distillery. Um, I'd never heard of them. What's this? Me okay. either. What, have you been living under a rock? Um, That's why I'm excited. I mean, I drink a lot of beers. I drink a lot of whiskeys. They're a brewery and distillery, but I've never heard of them. And somehow it stumbled across my Instagram feed. Here we are. And I said, what are those? What are you? And I looked into a little bit more yep. and then I ordered some. Yeah. Now this is rum barrels too. Yeah. Russian stout, which like, Russian Imperial stout, you had me. And me then too. Rum. And then I lost you. Yeah. <laughs> rum, I was like, hold the phone, hold the phone. But then I started reading about it a little bit more and seeing what they're doing. And they're like into some weird shit. So... I'm into that shit too. They're doing funky stuff. Yeah. They look, they sound like they're a pretty small distillery. Um, sorry a, that I didn't know about you before, but I know about you now. Yeah, it's a cool thing. So like, let's hope that you made something good here. Yeah. The smell is phenomenal. It does. It smells a little bit of coffee, a little bit of banana. To me, I'm getting like a wine. And I wouldn't expect that. Maybe that's the coffee note that you're picking up. Maybe that's what I'm uh, calling a wine note, but it's like a like dark, a dark fruit. Merlot. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Almost like you can smell tannins. Maybe yeah. that's what the lees is. Maybe oh, that's maybe it. that's what's up. Yeah, I don't know. Something cool going on. All right, I gotta try it. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Wow. I'm gonna let you speak first. That's unique as hell. Um, <laughs> it is very sweet. But it's not a thick, sweet, sickly. It doesn't feel like it's syrupy. No. It is sweet. But there is a sweetness in there that is just magnificent. <laughs> the coffee notes you get on the nose, you definitely get in the taste. I feel like I can taste that Russian Imperial Stout influence, for sure. It's the fucking Russians, gotta be. Mm. I like it a lot, actually. Even like, it's very I, I thought it would be too sweet for you. Yeah. Um... It's, it's good to try and have around because I think people who especially don't like whiskey might like this. There's almost like a menthol thing, like a minty thing happening as well. It's very unique. But might just be the influence of the, those barrels. Probably is. I should mention that there's two little stickers on here. The uh, Canadian Artisan Spirits Competition. Oh. They won bronze both in 2022 and 2023. 
Wow, okay. I can see why you're winning awards because this is this is pretty good. I'm happy I got it. It's unique. Ooh, it's extremely unique. Wow. I would call that pretty cool right there. I would recommend that to people. And not expensive. This was like 65 bucks. Oh, easy choice. Yeah. You stole it. For a five year, at least minimum five year yeah. whiskey. Yeah. And it's just some something cool, cool. Finishes. Something cool to have on your shelf. And a rum finish. That's what the sweetness is that you're mm. getting, of course, right? But it's uh, it's rummy. It's nice. I like it. I'm very happy with it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Me too. Cool. That's nice. Yeah? Yeah. Excellent. <laughs> Moon Distillery. Yeah. I'm glad we found you. Me too. The I'm universe glad. put us together. It finds its way across the universe and it lands in your body. Yep. This is good shit. I can't wait to try this now. Well, maybe we should just do that. Yeah, let's get out of here. All right. Moon, thank yeah. you so much. Dog. Dog. And to you, heathens. Yeah. Check them out. You can order it online. You'll love it. Mmm. Mmm. Yummy. We're finishing the class. Ha! <laughs> Bye! Woo!